swatch review on the NYX high voltage lipsticks and they look like this this is the spring collection that is going to come out um Ulta is going to have them by the end of February and NYX will have them like in the next few weeks up so keep an eye out for that and we're gonna go and swatch them and there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Hopefully I'm not missing any because I just threw them in my drawer and then I got out whatever I could find. Oh, actually, there's 22. I found another one in here. Uh, yeah. So, there's 22. Hopefully, there isn't any more because I don't know. So, anyways, we're going to go ahead and swatch them. Um, my lips are feeling kind of chappy right now because, I don't know, the lipstick that I was wearing kind of made them like that. So, they kind of hurt. So, but anyways... We're going to get started. All right, so we're going to go randomly. This one is an HVLS number 12. And they look like this. This is the packaging of them. And this is like a brown color. And here we go. These are the first times I'm going to try them, you guys. So we're trying this together. So don't mind me with my little reactions like, ooh. All right, okay, here we go. So. This is really creamy, you guys. Really creamy. What the first one looks like, this is like a brown lipstick and it's very creamy. It feels really hydrating. It doesn't feel dry at all. And let me see. They don't really have a bad smell. They do have like a lipstick smell. But this is really creamy. So this one is a number 12. Yeah, they all have numbers. So I'll just put them in numbers. And then I'll put them on the bottom bar for you guys. But this one is a number 12. And this is a brownie. A brown shade. And it doesn't have a name, I believe. I guess it just go by numbers. So like I said, this is to try is number 11 and it looks like this it's like a pinkish skin tone light pinky tone lipstick it looks really nice. I really like it. It's something that I would rock like in an everyday base if I'm doing like a smoky eye or just neutral eyes. I would totally wear this one. So this one is a number 11 and it's a pinky color. The next one that I'm going to go ahead and try, this one is a number 15 and this one's like a nude color. We're going to go ahead and try this one. color this is totally I would totally rock this color it is amazing I really like how it looks on me um, it's something that I would normally wear like an everyday use kind of lipstick that I would throw in my purse and then wear it um, yeah what do you guys think about this one it's a really pretty color guys and they're very creamy so I really like that nudie color and this is a number 19 and I'm going, of course, I'm going to do the first the duties. I really like them. So. There's another one. This is more of like a pinkish. Um, I don't know what color to describe it, but it is, it looks exactly like in a little um, container inside. Mm, it's not really my kind of color, but I know a lot of you guys would like, you know, totally rock this color. Mm, I don't know, I maybe have to get used to it because you guys know I love the nudes. And this is like totally a little bit, it's not too dark, too intense that I would be like, whoa. But it's like in between. So it's a 
Okay, so the next one we have four more nudes shades and yeah. So I'm going with number 21 and this is another like brown nude color. Uh, let's see how this one goes. So this one is really nude. Um, I don't know, I think even for me it's a little too nude. Maybe with a lip liner it would look good. Um, but so far for me, I think this is kind of too nude for me. I don't know. What do you guys think? But this one is number 21 if you guys are wondering. Um, yeah. So this one. So the next one, it is number 10. And this is another nude color. This one's like a grayish nude color. I don't know. What do you guys think about this one? I honestly don't like this one, to be honest with you guys. Mm, not my kind of color that I would totally wear. It is a nude color, but not my kind of shade I would pick for me so yeah so this one is number 10 if you guys are wondering and this is what it looks like let's move on to the next one okay so we have two more nudes to go and this one is a number 13 and let's see how this one looks So here is like another mobby, nudie lipstick. Mm, I don't know how I feel about this one. I feel, I don't know. It's different for me, but this is what it looks like for you guys. And this one's in number 13. Honestly, I don't think I would wear this for me. Um, I don't know. I don't like it, to be honest with you guys. Um, but maybe some of you can rock this color. Uh, maybe with a lip liner would also look better but yeah so this one is okay so the next one is in number five and it looks like this this one looks like a little bit darker we're gonna see how this one looks more it has a little bit more of like a pinkish tone to it this one's a lot nicer i would totally wear this one mm, they're so creamy guys i just kind of feel like i have to go over it a little bit mm, more than once just so that i can get like that color payoff but they're very like so smooth and very moisturizing so this is another color i really like it i would totally wear this one and then number zero four and this one is like a corally color. This one is in number 04 and this is what this one looks like. It's a corally pinkish nude color. Well, not really nude, but it is not too like whoa color, but yeah. So this is what this one looks like. I'm going to try on is the number one. And let's see how this one looks. So this one is a lot more, I feel like it's a lot more pigmented than the other ones that I tried. Like those um, silver, not silver, but grayish tones. This one's pretty. I would totally wear this one. It looks really nice and moisturizing to my lips. Um, it's a really nice color. So this one is in this one is number 14. So this is what this one looks like. I honestly, to be honest with you guys, I don't like it. <laughs> 
I don't think this is like a color that I would totally wear or pick for me. Mm, it is not my color, but I mean, for some of you guys, it might be, and I just don't like it on me. So this one is number 14. This one is the number 07, and this one's like another of oh, the corally orangey pinky colors. This one is a really bright pinkish color. Um, I like it, but I don't think I would wear it every day or something like that. But it's a really nice color. It's very pigmented. It's it's very pinky. And this one is a number zero number seventeen. And this is like a lavender purpley um, lipstick. So let's see. How So this one is a number 17 and off the bat already I can tell you that I don't like it on me. I think I look weird. So, but I know it, yeah, a lot of you guys would rock this color and it might look good. To me, it's like out of my comfort zone, like strictly nude colors. So, yeah. So this one is a number 17 and colors, well the dark colors. <laughs> Uh, I hope you guys are ready. So this one is in number 02 and this is like a berry color. It's it looks So this one looks really nice. I would totally rock this shade. It's a very berry color and it's really smooth and creamy on my lips. I really like it. I think it suits me. I don't know. I like these kind of berry colors recently. I started like feeling like I can totally rock them. And when I put them on, I feel a lot more confident for some reason. I don't know if that happens to you guys. But yeah, so this one is in number 02 and 09. And this one looks like a very chocolatey dark brown. I was thinking it was black, but it's not. It's like a, well, you know what? It doesn't even look brown. It looks like a vampy lip color. dark for my taste I don't know what do you guys think about this lippy uh, I think maybe like a lip liner or something because the edges are like all crappy but I'm trying to be perfect right now but yeah this one is in number 09 and it's very dark purple color I don't know I don't know I don't think I would wear this color it's too bright too dark for me I don't know but yeah, so let me know what you guys think about this one. Another, like, champagne color. We're going to try and see how it does. It's in number 16, and I think I would totally rock this color it looks really nice and looks like a vampy kind of lip something that i would totally rock um i would probably w put um some banana powder on top just to mat it out a little bit but other than that i think i really like it you guys what do you guys think about this one and like the other video um don't forget to comment which lippy you guys like this video might be pretty long so yeah so this one is a number 16 okay hopefully some of you guys are still here and i feel like this is the, like the longest video i've done of swatches but yeah let's get into it real quick so the next one i am going to be doing is number two and this one's like a red dark red lippy so let's try this one 
actually overdrew my lips on this one but let me tell you this one is a nice red shade i really like it it looks really nice it's something that i would totally rock like a pinup look and stuff or just an everyday kind of trying to look glamorous like this look that i have on right here actually looks nice so yeah this one is a number two it looks like that Okay, so the next one is another red one, and this one is a number six. And this one, I messed it up a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> to describe it but you know what I'm just going to swatch all three red ones so this one is in 06 this is the one that I have on my lips and then the one I previously tried on this is 02 so one's more cooler tone than the other one and then I do have another one well this one's like orangey this one's the number 22 and it looks like this I'm not gonna swatch it on my lips anymore but this is what they look so this one is number 22, the middle one is number 2, and then number 6 is the one that I have in my lips, and it's this one right here. So yeah, so those are the last three red ones that I have, and now we're going to go to the next last three, thank God, because those are a lot of lippies, so let's move on to the next one. Three more to go, and this one is in number 3, this is a pink lip. Let's see how this one looks like. Oh, this one's pretty. Wow, this one's really nice, you guys. Let me know what you guys think about this one. I really like it. Um, it looks really pretty. I really like it. I think I would totally wear this one, too. And this one is the number three. We're going to go ahead and try this one. This one is a number 08. This is a purple shade. So that's what this one looks like. I like it. I have wipey hair. I would totally wear this one. I like it. I would probably wear it with like a wing liner and no shower or anything this one is very pretty mm, i like it so yeah this one is in number zero eight okay you guys we have one more left and this one is in number 18 and this is an orange shade i don't know if my lips can take it anymore too many swatches and this is what it looks like it reminds me of like I, I don't know I think I don't know what lipstick I'm thinking about right now but it's an orange one it's from MAC it reminds me of it but this one is really nice you guys I like it um maybe I wouldn't wear it out but I do like it it's nice so yeah so this one is in number 18 so I really got, hope you guys enjoyed the lip swatches that I did for you for the high voltage lipsticks from NYX. Um, I thought I was never going to finish that. I was like, oh my god. I wanted to go up so many times on the video, you guys. It was too long. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy this video. I will be doing another series. So I might next time do, um, what is it? 
These are the NYX Simply Lip Cream. These are the like pencils, something like this. So yeah, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys all so much. Stay beautiful and see you guys later.